one of the first things that I always have to do is uh, take my little net here and I keep a binder clip on the bottom of it and I just roll it up all the way up as far as I can so it's nice and tight and I just clip it that way when I take the blower and try to blow off the bed all the hair comes out that will be trapped in this so yeah ah I love jacks, but Jesus, the dog hair. It drives me crazy. Now I gotta pull everything out. Just take it all out. Holy crap, the dog hair under here is absolutely well it's all blown away now i gotta take those out and this entire van needs to be blown out i haven't done a clean out in the van like this in so long yeah it's gonna be kind of gross man you don't realize how much junk you have in the van until you pull it all out and most of it is just junk that i don't need until i do need it Am I going to have another reform? Do I need to go through this entire van and just throw away a bunch of stuff that I don't use or need? How much space am I really taking up here? I mean, I'm limited on space to begin with, so yeah. I think I'm going to get rid of a lot of stuff. Well, I got to open up all the doors and everything because I'm going to blow out the van, get all the dust, crap, and dog hair much of it out as I can. I mean, look at that. <laughs> One thing about having a dog, the dog here gets pretty wild. Yeah. All right. You know, I wonder if I should pull out the, um, the chair too, or like the little couch thing. That's the easiest thing to get in and out because there's a ton of dog here um, back there too. You know what, I think I'm gonna do it. Wow, wild. Yeah, it's kinda interesting. This is the first time my uh, couch has been out of the van since, since it was built. I mean, look at all this space I have. <laughs> it's almost weird. <laughs> so I'm gonna get all this stuff out and then uh, I'm gonna start blowing this thing out cause uh, yeah. I gotta shoot all the dust and hair both ways because the blower doesn't get it all out this way. So I gotta shoot it all that way and then blow it out that way and then vice versa. I mean, you could spend easily half an hour just blowing out this van and you still won't even get all of it. It's, it's amazing. The dog hair is just truly amazing. Um, this is not gonna be the best clean out uh, because I don't have, I mean, if I'm at, I should have done this at the storage unit where I have like everything, but this is gonna be a decent clean out and uh, should be good enough for now. So after I'm done uh, blowing out the van and getting everything done, I've got some spray cleaner and a rag and I'm gonna go around and just wipe every surface that I can. And uh, especially the front, um, by the, your feet area and the wheel wells and all that. Just clean your van, keep your van as clean as you can and that's what I'm gonna do because uh, it's my home and uh, I've been kind of neglecting it a little bit. So yeah.
Yeah, I mean, even no matter how many times you blow it out, the dog hair is just so bad. Having a dog in the van kind of sucks, especially a dog that sheds like crazy, like Jax. Um, I've been trying to keep him out of the bed as much as I can. I love him up on the bed, and a lot of times he'll jump up there and he'll kind of like cuddle up with me, and I love that, you know, but... I try to keep them off the bed as much as I can because the dog hair just gets too much. I had to blow off the bed every night that he's on there. Every night I got to blow it off. And it's just, you know, I got to open the doors and then the winter it sucks because it's cold and I got to blow. I mean, it only takes literally three to four minutes, five minutes, whatever. It's not a big deal. It's just, it gets annoying after a while. So lately I've been trying to keep them off the bed. But uh, yeah, I'm almost done here. So I'm going to finish up put everything back in the garage and then uh, do once overall blowing it out and uh, wiping surfaces down and then uh, yeah it's good for now you know a clean van is a happy van so yeah I just got this uh, little air purifier um, I had another one on here but it, it didn't work that well I barely noticed a difference the little mo it was one motor and it was kind of weak this one's a lot better it blows out this way it's got two motors so it blows out this way and this way. So um, I kept it running like all day one time and I came back in here and I kind of felt a little bit, I don't know, it just felt a little fresher. So this thing was like 30 bucks on Amazon. It's USB powered, which is nice. I would highly recommend a 12 volt air air freshener. No, air, uh, shit, what is it called? Air, um, air filter, there's a name for it and I'm gonna remember it later. Um, air purifier, God, a 12 volt air purifier in the van. Look them up. There's dozens of them. This one is pretty good. Definitely check it out. Well, I'm pretty much finished. I just spent like the last two and a half hours just cleaning everything, you know, and you can only do so much, but, uh, even after all that, I still, there's still dog hair everywhere. You know, you can only try. Uh, I'm gonna do this again eventually here and when I do I want to go through all my drawers too you know because there's a bunch of crap there and I want to be at the storage unit for that because I don't have a garbage here other than my little garbage and you know and I kind of running out of like rags and stuff so yeah um, what time is it I don't even know it's got to be like four or five o'clock I think, uh, I think I'm gonna attempt to go fishing. Maybe, maybe not, I don't know. I'm kinda hungry, I'm gonna grab something to eat. How about that? <sighs> yeah, keeping clean in the van definitely helps uh, keep the van or your van life more comfortable. So definitely have a bunch of uh, wipes and you know, just keep your van clean. What I really should be doing, and I need to do, because I haven't done it in over a week, just over a week, is uh, laundry, and yeah, I need to go to a laundry bin, uh, you know, sheets and everything, get those cleaned. So yeah, uh, this video was literally just me cleaning out the van. Uh, if you made it this far, you're the weirdo, not me, but you know what, Chrome was right, we're all a bunch of weirdos, I guess. <laughs> We're all just a little bit weird. Um, earlier I was at that, uh, in the last video, I was at that trailer. And I don't know why that intrigued me so much. It was literally a hunk of junk. But, hey, we're all, little, we're all just a little bit weird, right? So, anyways, thanks for watching. Like, share, subscribe. Uh, keep it simple and uh, keep it real. And I will see you guys on the next one. Why you gotta love van life. There's people drag racing right outside the van on the street that I'm parked on. Check this out. There they are. There's like a green one and a black one. Oh, there they go! There they go! Don't hit my van, no motherfucker! Oh, there they go! <laughs> That's crazy, dude. It's cool, as long as they don't...
it's cool as long as they don't hit my van.